What does it mean that a Rebbe is Atma Sumahos Malubash Beguf? Obviously, the concept of this, there's a lot, a lot that has to be spoken at length, and it's not the time and the place for it. Everyone can read it in the Sikha inside. The Sikha is printed in Lukut Sikhas, where the Rebbe, the famous Sikha of Achen Shul Pesach Tav Shin Yud, where the Rebbe speaks about it. I want to just mention a few quick points. There was a story of a bunch of, a group of people that came to the Rebbe, college students, or university students, and this was in the earlier years of the Rebbe's leadership. And of course, they came to 770. It was a whole new experience for them. They'd never seen, it's not just the chassidim with the beards, with the hats, but the fact that these people, they learn chassidus before davening, they daven at length, sometimes they can be davening all day shab. It was all new things for these who most of them were not necessarily from, and even if they were, they, weren't, they, didn't, they didn't know this whole concept of chassidim. The one thing which was the most astounding to them was you can't be for a Shabbos by Chassidim and not see their yachas, the way that they relate to the Rebbe. That for a Chassid, any question he has, business, he asks the Rebbe, medicine, he asks the Rebbe, make operation, he asks the Rebbe, should I travel, he asks the Rebbe. And the young people, they knew you ask a Rabbi when you have a Allah question. What is this thing of asking the Rebbe for a business question? for a medical question. And so they asked the Chassidim, can a Rebbe make a mistake? He said, no. I mean, that's an obvious question because if a Rebbe can make a mistake, you shouldn't be asking him life and death questions. He said, no, a Rebbe can't make a mistake. So he said, well, does the Rebbe have a pencil? Yes. Does the Rebbe have an eraser, a rubber in the back of a pen? Yes. Why does the Rebbe need a rubber if the Rebbe can't make a mistake? So the Chassidim said, sometimes you write an idea you get a new idea which is even higher than the previous one, so you need to erase the previous one to make space for the new one. Okay, nice answer. After Shabbos, they went into Yechidus by the Rebbe, and the Rebbe said, do you have anything to ask? So they asked, can a Rebbe make a mistake? And the Rebbe answered them the following, in truth, a Jew cannot make a mistake because a Jew is part of Hashem. Can God make mistakes? No. Can a Jew make a mistake? Also not. Only that by us we don't know where it comes from because there's the animal soul that covers over the godly soul that's part of God. And therefore we don't know where the idea is coming from. Whereas a Rebbe, his neshama is fully revealed in his connection to Hashem. In a similar manner, in short, the idea of Atzmos Melubesh Beguf, the truth is, the Alte Rebbe says it in Tanya and we know in Chsidis that a neshama is a chelek aleika mimal mamish. The Alte Rebbe has the word mamish, it's an actual part of Hashem. In fact, the Rebbe Rashab one time expressed himself in a mimer, Kuk nishtavdem was a geilim, der geilim at bashaf and asmos umhos, but the Rebbe Rashab used the lashon, used words that said that the uh, neshama is atzmos umhos in a sack of flesh and bones. So the concept of the neshama being atzmos umhos, that's something we know. It's only that by us, we don't feel it, it's not revealed. A Rebbe is the epitome of what we really are in its fullest and most revealed way so that we can connect to what we are. A Rebbe is one with Hashem because in essence we're one with Hashem. But we don't feel our being one with Hashem by connecting to a Rebbe. It becomes that the Chassid, the Rebbe and Hashem are all one thing in a sense that there's no difference and there's not able to be a difference. <coughs> and as such, in a Rebbe, it's a revealed concept that it's the essence of Hashem, the way it's in the body, which makes us understand that this is in essence, although we don't feel it and we don't connect to it properly, what we really are and what we should strive to be.